Okay, class, what we're going to do today is look up and find some different things about saving and finding images within Google. So what you need to do first is click on Google Images. That comes up. You've probably all done this before. But what we want to use this for is for our section on controlling bacteria and foodborne illness. So I need some different pictures to put on my poster or to put on my presentation. So I'm going to type bacteria. And there it is, starts to come up Click on that. So here comes tons of different pictures of bacteria, all right, different things I would like and different stuff you can go through and come up with a picture that you find appropriate to be put onto yours. But let's say you wanted to get a little more advanced with it. This is something new I learned over the summer. So what you wanna do is go to settings, advanced search, and it brings up a whole new page for you. On this page, you can narrow it down. And what I want you to try to do is to come up with a clip art version. So find images of bacteria. We don't really care about the size. We would prefer color. All right, so let's go with full color. And then type any type of image. If you click on any type of image, you can come up with all these different things, face, photo, clip art, whatever. I want clip art. So we're going to clip on that. And one other thing I'd like you to look at <clears throat> excuse me, is down here at the bottom, this filtered and licensing usage rights. A lot of times you can come across things that people have taken pictures of and you don't want to use theirs unless you have to pay for it. So you want to look for free things. So we're going to click on that and it says free to use or share. We click there. This will then narrow down our advanced search greatly. So I want to go ahead and price the advanced search. And here we go tons of different bacteria that we can bring up and we could put on. So you're looking down through, you will find something you think is funny. Let's say this one right here. I would double click on it. I want to open it up. I want to copy image or sorry, save image as. All right, here's my pictures. I want to save it and I'll put it on there. Get up here. Let's name it bacteria three. and save. I've now saved that as bacteria three. This image will come up if I go back through into my pictures. So to show you where that's at, I can close this. All right. You want to go back down here to the bottom of your screen. All right. Your start menu, pull it up, go up to where it says pictures, click on it and boom, there's all your different ones. One of the bacteria I saved earlier, bacteria two and bacteria three. This puts it in a real easy location that I now have them all saved and I can use them and print them or add them to any type of presentation I want to do. Hopefully this is a good way to show you different ways to search within Google Images. Good luck and have fun with your assignment.